Good morning, Sydney, and welcome to Mornings with Cal. And I'm Greg. Let's get straight into it. We want to know the weather forecast. Our weather girl, Trisha, is out on the field right now. Trisha, can you hear us? Uh, yeah, guys, not great. I thought I'd be at the beach, so. Where are you, Trisha? No idea, Cal, but I think I'm in the wrong place. Looks like that subway is really kicking in, huh? <laughs> yeah, it does. All right, so straight on to sport. Where Friday's game of NRL has seen the Bears take a mighty fall. Dave, our sports two guy, has the report here. Hey guys, uh, yeah, yeah, it was good. Um, it was bad. It was, it was all right. The game just kept on going until the final buzzer went off. Uh, some people were happy. Some, some people were sad. There were a few uh, goals and um, uh, touchdowns. Uh, but basket scored, but it was electric, though the energy was a bit low. Yeah. It was a great win, but also a really sad loss for our Bears. Yeah. Well, I'm sure it was a game to be seen. On to tonight's story, where a young girl rises from the dead to go to college. What? That's right, Cal. Last month, 19-year-old Rebecca Davies died from the Ebola disease after her gap year in Africa. Only last week, Rebecca rose from the dead, giving doctors the shock of their lives. Rebecca, still considered to be legally deceased, has, be <clears throat> has been given the opportunity to go to college. Rebecca is incredibly keen to fill up her brain with knowledge. And eat everyone else's in the process. A beautiful story for everyone there. If you can do it, Rebecca, so can we. Now on to our breaking news report tonight. Small town shocked by a rage. Streak it. <laughs> Streaking... Streaker? I messed up. Terrorising their local residents. Over to you, Brenda. Small town of Mona Vale, Sydney has been shaken today when local part-time ninja Gary Fronter went on what's being called Thursday Streaking Rampage. We have Brian, who is a local here today, um, who saw the ordeal happen. Michael, explain to the viewers what exactly happened. Well, Gary was just like, he came out and his dick was flying around everywhere like a helicopter. And, and also, fucking around the pussy. And that's all we have time for this morning. Tune in at seven tonight to find out how to lose 40 kilos in eight minutes. I'm Cal. And I'm Greg. And I'm Cal.